I'm going to take this cup, put him in there, and I'm going to take a piece of paper, slide it in, and take this cup, throw it outside. What's up everybody? I kind of realized that I didn't really finish this top layer. So we're going to finish this top layer right now. So as y'all know, this top floor is phenomenal, man. Like I really want to say this is one of the coolest ideas I came up with from scratch. Like I didn't use nothing as a reference or anything. This was all just out my brain into the game. You got to love that, man. I just came in from uh, outside tilling my yard again. My neighbor actually drove his Buick over the grass. I had to put a clip in to show you. We we was on some extra, but yeah, yo, it was fun, yo. So let's fix this up. Let me think about some stuff. I'm kind of in a tough situation because I don't really like this ladder look at all. It's okay, but at the same time, it's kind of ugly. Like not on down there, but up here, it's like eh. You got this grand, beautiful upstairs it ain't already put food out here and went bad uh and then you got a ladder to get up here like that's kind of eh, kind of messes you up let me let me try some steps let me try some steps let me just see some things so i could put some steps right here that would take me up like that now how would that look with the wall okay that's gonna mess that door up i could move that door over though I don't really like that though going that way I don't know man like I really didn't give myself a lot of room here at all and then the way these spiral staircases work I don't think that they work properly you know maybe I could just do an elevator maybe I could just do an elevator how about we just do an elevator I mean yeah I could do an elevator I could cut in where could I cut in at I could cut in right here Big shout out to everybody on Instagram, man. I see you. You know, Instagram definitely ain't what it used to be, bro. I used to get like six, seven hundred likes, sometimes a thousand likes. This picture only got 150 likes. But shout out to everybody that went and liked my picture on Instagram, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, just like on YouTube, I always go read the comments and heart all the comments to let everybody know that I, I saw you and I, I love you for, for showing me love. It's crazy because this picture right here looks exactly like right now because it's just my I took it from my camera. Uh, but yeah, I, I man, I got so much stuff for y'all to, to, to look at as far as short content and I just have not put it completely out yet. But I'm starting to on TikTok, Instagram. So make sure y'all go follow me on there, man. And like I said, the one thing I need y'all to do if you don't do nothing else is share them with your friends. If you think they funny, if you think they dope, creative, whatever, like them and share them with your people, man, because I think that's going to be our ticket out the hood. <clears throat> that's going to be our ticket out the hood, man. It's them shorts. It may not be, but I think that's going to be a ticket out the hood just because people blow up off shorts all the time. But uh, all right, let, let's get let's get in here, man. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? I need some steps. I need steps. Now, what about how how do I want to do the steps? I don't really want to do no spiral stairs because I feel like with them it's not really part of the game, so it might not work properly. I could do an elevator. That's what I said I was gonna do. But the elevator would have <coughs> the elevator would have to be right here, and that's kinda in the way. Maybe not though. Yeah, it would be because the elevator would literally be like in this vicinity and that's going to be unrealistic if it's not. I mean, I could put it right where this Buddha is, but like that Buddha like that is just so dope. Like this Buddha is just such a good vibe right there. I really don't want to change that like at all. I'm not going to change that at all. So I could do one or two things. I could do an elevator. Or I could try to fit some stairs in here. I don't know which one it's going to be. But it's going to be one of them two. Okay, so we got up, down, elevator, whatever. This is the tall one. So we want this one. So I can put an elevator here. Take the closet out of this room. And the elevator shoots you up here like this. That would be dope. The elevator situation would be dope. Now, I know you don't have to do it like exactly where it is, but if we're going to do it, we want it to be realistic. 
and it's got to be accessible by the whole family and see the thing about up here is it ain't a whole lot of room up here like i'm thinking what can we do up here in this area right here that's gonna be really useful like what else can we do i mean i could open it up more so it's even more space up here for grass i could definitely do that but i mean i kind of like it the way it is to be honest what if we put the elevator right here and yeah, what if we put the elevator right there so on the outside nah i wouldn't want to do that because then we got the basketball hoop okay we'll leave the elevator inside then <clears throat> i'm thinking here oh no it would have to be here see in a perfect situation this would be where the elevator was because then that would be right next to the ladder like this well then that's gonna be in front of the door ain't it damn you know what even if i did this the door is in the way the only thing i have to do is the ladder like because there's no way i'm gonna do this realistically unless i move the buddha and just have an elevator there which look how lame that is now it looks like the shining instead of like zen vibes <clears throat> damn man i really might just have to lead a ladder because i'm not seeing no other way to do this with no elevator without tearing up everything and i really truly really truly don't want to tear up everything and then what about steps i could do the stairs here or here if i go here does that interfere with that door it actually doesn't that doesn't interfere with the door it does kind of mess buddha up though buddha kind of buddha kind of blocked now i don't know if i like that because you block buddha off i mean he's still there but you definitely blocked him off kind of disrespected buddha by putting that right in front of his face like that you know what i mean i don't know if i want to disrespect buddha like that it it is better than the other steps though because at least with these it's not fully blocking it like if i put something like this there it's fully blocking that now so i mean with these at least it keeps the open look this might be so it's either this or the ladder so with this you come up the steps and then it's like we could actually do a wall here and a wall here and then you just like come up the steps or we could do a fence type thing and then just do that around the edge i don't know bro like i just know the ladder like imagine trying to carry a plate up here or anything up here and you got to take it up a ladder even though pretty much everything you need is out here still i mean who wants to really do that so i'm really thinking the stairs these stairs is gonna be what we do they don't interfere with the doors which i'm i'm hoping i gotta make sure and i mean they don't mess the house up too bad so i'm thinking that's what we gonna do i still haven't decided what i'm gonna make this up here though because like i don't know what to do up here i mean it's cool it's a cool area but like what do we want to do here let's think a minute what would you do outside where do you where you wanted something enclosed we already got the grill and the eating thing outside got the tent the swing the entertainment the hot tub i mean what would you want indoor next to a pool next to an outdoor eating area what would you want i don't know what i'm thinking though is you could just go ahead and block this off and this could be a room of some sort this is just where you come up like the little lobby area you could probably do like some couches something like that just to make it you know feel like a little lobby area is it necessary no uh but we can do it and we can make it feel like it, it's necessary which i'll take these plants you could go ahead and drop them in boom bop throw a rug down here boom throw a little table down here look how quick i can do this this is my um this is my go-to look though so it's not like groundbreaking like the outdoor thing that was groundbreaking i had never done nothing like that before this what i'm doing right now this is not groundbreaking this is everyday life pierre escargo for your everyday life what is that from? that's all that i'm like i know that sound like something and then lord it was lloyd beth denberg for vital information for your everyday life something like that big shout out to the 90s kids bro y'all y'all my family you know what i'm saying big shout out to gen, gen z too though gen z i'm rocking with y'all even though y'all got some crazies 
Y'all know y'all got crazy ass people in y'all generation. Don't even sit there and act like you don't. You know you got some some Looney Tunes. But uh, I'm rocking with y'all. You know what I'm saying? Gen Z, lit. I feel like I'm part of Gen Z, even though I'm, I, I don't think I am. But I feel like I'm part of it because I, I'm online. Like I'm online and I'm I'm like connected, so I feel like I'm part of it, but I'm not. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm just an old man. I ain't even old, but you know what I'm saying. We lit. We still lit. We still doing it. We still doing our Disney out here. Uh, I don't know what color I want to go with. I was gonna go with the yellow, but I, I don't know. Black and yellow. You know what I mean? I don't know if I want to go dark or light, but right now we're kind of in the middle of both. So yeah, here we just got like a little area where you can sit. Uh, do we want all these mirrors though? Or do we want some art? I think I want some art. I definitely want some art. What is this? Oh, this is a, what you call it. Uh, that's not really the one I wanted to use. I gotta be careful using this one because I got all kind of smut in here. Hmm. I don't know if I want to do that like that or not. I kind of want to do white, like really art studio vibes. So let's do white. Let's let's go all white up here. I haven't done white in a long time. I usually do this black and brown now. We can keep the windows, but let's do a white look. Matter of fact, can I do the glass floor? I forgot what I used for glass floors. I think it was a rug though. Wasn't it a rug? That was the glass floors. Yeah, there it is. Mirror floor. Yeah, let's go with the glass flow. Oh, that's going to mess up the rug. Is it worth it, though? I mean, the glass floor does hit different. It does. But I like that rug. I really wish they just put a glass floor in the game. But I know it's like they probably don't want to have it run too slow. But like a shiny glass floor? Psh, that'd be a whole nother level, man whole nother level i don't know i'm just thinking like an art studio type of look but then what is this gonna be what room is this gonna be i mean it's got a big tree going through it but like what room could this be i guess it could be like a this could be like the new studio so instead of us cramming everything down in here upstairs could be like the streaming room i don't know though kind of makes me rethink some stuff plus this room is really tall I need to get some lights up here too. I'm gonna have to grid these out so they make sense. Alright, that's the grid right there. Yep, yeah, that's perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Boom. Lit that up a lot. And then we'll go we'll go with the same color wall just to see what it looks like. Mm, maybe I should go with the same colors though. That way it ties it together. But I feel like with this you don't want to have carpet. Well, I guess you could have carpet. I'm just trying to see, maybe. I don't know if I want to tie the outdoor indoor or just make this indoor. Because if I just do indoor, then this is kind of pointless. This would need to go back that color. These would need to go back black. And then we do the black and brown community like we've been doing throughout the whole house. See, now it's just like a little living room up here where you can sit and talk. But I mean, do we really need a living room up here where you can sit and talk? I feel like that's so unnecessary. You got a spot to sit and talk over here and downstairs. A big ass living room to sit and talk. I feel like that's a dumb thing to do there. I was thinking about putting the kids rooms up here, but then I was like, would you really want your kids to be above you though? Like. I mean, it would be kind of lit if I put the kids' rooms upstairs because then they could kind of have it upstairs to they self a little bit. But then we got to move this basketball hoop over and then move the door over. That way I can split these rooms where I can have the girls' room and then the boys' room, which I don't really mind doing. Let me see something real quick. How big is the room they're in? Let's just copy and then see. Okay, so the size of the room they're in is actually the same size as the square. The square is a little bit bigger. So I could put one of their rooms right here. Actually extend it, make it a little bit bigger. And they could have a room here. And then I could double it, boom, right here. They say I ain't got no funds. And then I could double it right here. 
Now, if I do that, there will be only one spot. I had to put their door over on this side because they're not going to be. I had to do it like that and then put the door over here like there. And then I'll have to move this basketball hoop over here, move this door over here like that. And then I realized that honestly, I can get rid of these steps because I can't get up there anyway. I might keep the steps just for a little bit of realism, but like it's kind of unnecessary because I can't actually get up there. Damn, it's a fly in here. Now I gotta go into Zen mode and try to catch this bitch. <sighs> I'm the king of catching flies though, bro. I lure them in and then I'm able to like get them and I always capture them though because, you know, try to save the animals and the bugs. Plus, it's a little easier. That bitch on the ceiling. I'm going to close him in here. Oh, look. He's zooming. He's zooming. He, got, he attracted to this ring light though. So I just got to sit and wait, man. Got to sit and wait until he, until he get on the wall. I want him to get on the wall. I'm going to take this cup. Put him in there, and I'm gonna take a piece of paper, slide it in, then take this cup, throw it outside. But he keep landing on the fucking ceiling, like, bruh, I can't get you from the ceiling, and I might have to take you out. I don't wanna take you out, but if you keep landing on the ceiling, I'm gonna have to pop you. Maybe I could take this and go, bing. That ain't really flat. Damn, he just flew away. <sighs> I gotta wait it out, wait it out, wait it out. I got the ceiling fan going too, so he like tripping. Bro, just land on the wall. Like, these eye floaters just fucking up my damn cat vision. I keep seeing these floaters and I'm thinking it's the fly. I might take this if he land on that ceiling and just go pop. Like I said, I hate to kill him, but when they're acting dumb, sometimes you have to. It's just the way of the world sometimes. Got that bitch. Got that bitch in this cup. Y'all wanna rock the hottest merch in the game? Well, go over to samedaniel.com slash shop, man, where you can get all the new merch that I drop. I got hoodies, t-shirts, pillows, phone cases coming, lanyards, all kind of stuff, man. So go over to samedaniel.com slash shop, get the hottest merch, man. I got it on right now, because it's just so fly. Also, if you want my Uncensored Sim videos, you want access to all my content before it hits YouTube, and some content that never hits YouTube that's strictly exclusive, you gotta go over to the OnlyFans, man. Let's get back into the video. So I went back on my idea. I'm not going to do the kids' rooms up here. I caught the fly too, by the way. I told you I'm like samurai fly catcher over here. But uh, I just don't know what to put in this room right here, man. Like I don't know. Let's get these a little bit more room. Yeah, I just, I don't know what I'm gonna do, man. I don't, I don't really want to move the kids' rooms up here. I don't think. Let me see if this even works. Cause if they can't get out this room, that's gonna be a big time problem. Let's just take Kyra. Oh, Kyra can't go in there, can she? Oh, yeah, she can. She can. Let's have Kyra go in there, and I, I hope she can. If she can go in there, we good. Okay, perfect. So she can still go in there. You can still use that, and then you can go upstairs. We'll have Kyra go upstairs, too. See, that just looks, that just looks better, man, than climbing up the ladder. I mean, the ladder is cool, but that just looks better. And they can go right out here which is cool and then you can go swing on the swings let's just go ahead and swing just to see how that's looking them shoes is fresh it's kind of dark up here during the day though oh it's in the morning no wonder it's so dark up here you know i just realized that the trees actually move in the wind how am i just realizing that trees move in the wind that is actually really nice how did i never notice that they actually move in the wind damn i just the bushes don't move, but the trees do. Damn, the branches actually moving. Uh, that's crazy. I never remember that, ever seeing that. I mean, it kind of reminds me of Animal Crossing, because that's like the best when it's windy. Uh, okay, so this is this is lit up here, man. I don't know how he's sleeping in the hot tub and clothes. I don't think I finished his outfit, so he got that same outfit. I guess I'll just make this a room, just like with some normal lights in it. I don't know why this running so slow. Now watch this. As soon as I hit settings, boom. Now the game runs fine again. I, I still don't get that. That's like the dumbest thing ever. But at least it gets back working fast. Then we'll just make all of these small. I actually might make this like a streaming recording room. I would say like a kid's playroom. But like, do you really need a kid's playroom? 
and we got all this lit stuff going on probably not if y'all got any ideas what I can make that room post in the comments because y'all know I'll be looking for suggestions okay so yes yeah, it's, it's not bad it's not bad it's not great but it's not bad at least this is kind of like part of the house instead of it being like just a ladder going up to a room I think this looks great. I'm going to go ahead and go back in bit, uh, live mode, though, and speed up the time a little bit. Because I want to see what it looks like during the day. Bro, I never remember seeing these trees move. That's, like, really messing me up because I never remember seeing trees move like this. And they're all moving. Like, even the ones down here are moving. That has to be new, yo. That has to be new. Or maybe I just never focused on trees like that. But I never remember trees moving that much. Mostly these, these is going crazy. I love this upstairs oasis. Look at them, even the ones down here are moving. Maybe I'm just being dumb and I never paid any attention to it. I might have to go back and look at previous Sim videos because I swear I never noticed that. All the kids is here at the house doing whatever they want to do. What is this? Oh, that's a toy. Why is her hair a different color every time I see her? Now her hair is green. She actually remind me of this. Fortnite toy. <laughs> Trying to reach it. Look, tell me, she, tell me she don't look just like this, yo. Big shout out to the Fortnite folks. Y'all know exactly who this is. They over here watching Moana. This fits perfectly in this house. You know, I still haven't watched Moana. <laughs> like one of the movies that like you would think I would be in love with. I've never even seen it. I really gotta watch that, man. I really gotta watch that. But as far as the house goes i think this is great upstairs is phenomenal i think this is just the best thing ever and then downstairs i might do a little renovating down here possibly in the future i don't know with what maybe this room i might end up separating the gym <clears throat> what is up with my throat bruh i might end up separating the gym from the office so i might make this a gym or i might make this a gym and that the office I don't know if I want to have a gym right above my bedroom because that might be lame. But I might do, I think I'm going to do the office up here actually. Because you can come up there, you kind of separate from the rest of the house. Come up there, work on your stuff with your office, maybe take a break, go outside, chill out outside real quick, come back in. You got a little break area right there. Yeah, this is definitely going to be an office. I just made it a perfect, this is actually a perfect place for an office because it kind of gives you an office vibe like you got a lobby and then you got the outdoor area if you need to go take a break from the office so yeah this is definitely an office we're not even gonna waste no time doing this this is gonna be the new office and what's cool is we got enough room now we could actually i might have to move this tree though i hate that because this tree was like in a good spot but i can't deal with this tree like I might have to get a different type of tree because I can't deal with that tree all up in my space like that. Is this one too small you think? This is a tiny tree and it's still going through the damn wall. I need like a thin, damn this is really too close to this. Yeah these are way too thick. This is the one I just had. This one's way too thick, way too thick. See I don't want a, I don't want an evergreen tree up here. This tree is too thick. It's like a little maple tree and it's still too thick. I guess I could move it over though. Like that. That ain't bad. We'll keep it small though. I mean, I don't know if this would interfere with anything if I moved it over. But it does kind of kill the vibe. So I'm going to just leave it there. I think that's cool. It's still in the mulch. So it still makes sense. You get a little bit more visuals and then I had this room back so I don't have to keep looking at these leaves go through the wall like that because that really can mess up the, the vibe. This one's already going through but it's so high up that it don't affect it that much. So we're going to take these TVs, bring them upstairs, and then I want to take another one of these. You know what? I don't actually want to do two of these because these aren't real desks. We can have a little camera up here. Yeah, see, this is going to be nice. So this is going to be where everybody do the recording at. And then it kind of makes sense to have a mini fridge up here, too, because you're far away from the kitchen. You don't necessarily need the grill. Uh, do I take the bookcases, too? Yeah, possibly, possibly. This video is going to be longer than I thought it was going to be. 
but I might as well hook this up. I don't know if I'm going to still use that picture or not. Okay, we good. We good. And then I'll probably take this and put two of these in here just to add that same kind of energy upstairs. Even though the plants I got now might be better than these makeshift plants. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll figure that out when we get to that point. We'll just pop this in like these. Uh, we can put the poster. Okay, so that'll shimmy it that way. That'll shimmy it that way. And then we'll put the poster like here. That's supposed to be like that. But I could actually go ahead and do this. I don't need two of them though. We'll just do the one. That way it don't really interfere with nothing. We'll just do the one. And then maybe I'll take that makeup chair. Ain't that makeup chair in here too? That's like part of the activity thing, right? Yeah, because you can make people over. That uh, that will be beneficial because I need to have some friends for my kids. And you know they're going to need made over. You know that. You know they're going to need some help. He going to need some milk. Oh, this is a little garden spot. This would have been really good right here. I wonder what would happen if I put that right there. Do you think that's going they're going to be able to play basketball? Let's find out, actually. Can kids play basketball? I hope they can. Bruh, wait a minute. This game is running stupid slow. Can they play? Yeah, shoot around. Let's see how this basketball thing works. I really hope it works with that under it. It looked like it's gonna work. Yeah, okay, perfect. It does work. But does this work? Make an arrangement all... Oh, she ain't got no... You know what? This ain't gonna really serve much purpose here. But it's good to know that I can have something under there. Look at, uh... What's her name? Hakari. Going in. That's cool though. I can put something there, but I ain't gonna trip on that right now. I'm trying to get this little office set up. Had a little office set up going. And then this will just be a home gym. Which is cool. You know what I mean? We don't really need the home gym to be crazy. Uh, I guess we could just throw that up there. I might change that whole situation. Because I actually like this picture a little bit better. Mostly for gaming. So yeah, we might get rid of the Martin ones. Put that one up there. That's like classic gaming right there. Love that. Uh, then I need to get a desk. I definitely need a desk. And I need a desk that's going to match that desk. Which I don't think they got one that matches that desk. But we're going to... I did see one in here. Because I was going to put it downstairs. Yeah, this. This was dope, though. And I almost want to just do this and forget about this and just put these two together because this looks great but I don't know what y'all think let's see if I can find a really thin plant to go in this corner it's got to be really really thin like bamboo that's about the only thing that's gonna fit in this corner right it's bamboo this kind of fits but not really here's the little bamboo sticks but where's the actual bamboo base I think you can put it in whatever you want to though so if I set this over here and set this one over here, I should just be able to drop these sticks. Yeah, drop the sticks right in there. Preferably, I just wanted to grab the one that it actually came with, but since it's playing games, that's all right. I do want to add a little extra lightage in here just to be extra because like sconces always make stuff look good. And then as far as the computer, I kind of want to go ahead and do that do my own thing with that so we'll just do like max <laughs> that don't really make sense for gaming though do it maybe we'll go with the normal gaming pc they got all this stuff that you can't even unlock though this one is dope where's that one with the big monitor though this one this is the biggest monitor one i have oh no that is yeah let's go with these these look really good there too and then can I add stuff to this desk? Because if I can add stuff to this desk, it's about to be a game changer, bro. I kind of like this better than that. I kind of like this picture better. But it's white, and I wish it was black because it doesn't match being white. Did I make that one in black? I might have. Let's see. It's a possibility, but I might not have. Yeah, I might not have made that black. Dang. That would have been good, too. Because I like this one. And maybe I'll just keep it white. Who knows? Because this desk isn't really dark. Oh, it can be, though. It could be white, too. 
I like that stone color though. That stone color is kind of nice. It could even be a brown stone, which is like super rich. What y'all like better, this stone or that brown stone? I kind of like that brown stone. But what really matters is can we put stuff on this desk? Ooh, we can. That's about to be crazy. So we can have like fancy stuff on here. I probably could even put a decorative. Because some of these are decorative. They're not actually computers. I could probably throw some of them on there. Like this one's decorative. Yeah, you can. So you can have like the real crazy setup going. This another. No, that's not another one. So you got some iPads. You got... Uh, what else is decorative? Well, you could put a switch up here if you really wanted to. This is a double monitor gaming setup. How did I not see this the first time? So this is technically one computer. How does that work with them using that, though? I don't know. I don't know. I kind of like how that looks, though. That definitely looks like some gaming action. But I like the one big monitor. I mean, preferably... Like the way my setup, y'all know my setup, I got a 65 and a 55 stacked, which is more like this. So I'm on this monitor and then up top will be like the secondary one. But see, this is cool too, because then you can have your OBS over there, gaming over here. But like me being symmetrical, I like having the one in the middle. So I'm looking, then I can have one to the left. So I mean, I don't know. You know, I like to think way too deep about this stuff. This one's decorative too. So you can really go crazy. See, I like that. So you can have like your, your official computer and then your... This is nice. I like this a lot. Or we can pull this one over like this. This is kind of hanging off the desk though, ain't it? But see, what's cool about that though is that makes sense because you might want to have a secondary computer for your editing or your uh, whatever, you know? That actually fits there good too. I think I like that space better right there because that's still on the desk and it's still got a little room for the keyboard like that. Is that on it? It seems like this one ain't clicking into the same spot. See, that's not, I mean, it's, it's good enough, but that's all right. They don't have to be exactly the same. For some reason, that one's not clicking into the same spot, though. And then I'll go in and fix what they on in a minute. Then with the plants, we could just kind of throw some plants on here. It's a nice setup, man. My, my setup, y'all know, is kind of pink, white, stuff like that. I kind of, I like this brown, man. This brown stone with the plant action going. I might have to try something like that in the future. That's kind of nice. And then as far as this, let's see what we got. I added a couple. We got Daniela Perkins. One is on the Hub account. <laughs> this is actually my laptop screenshot, I think, when I was on Amazon. Then this is like, you already know. Then we got like Fortnite. Uh, I'm thinking, just for the sake of how this looks, we could be on Amazon on that one. And then over here, I don't think I did anything with these, so this is just whatever they put on here. That one could be on that, and then this one could be, say, on this. Something different. And then we could add the chairs. See, what's cool about this is you actually can use it as a desk, but it's still got a lot of decoration space to do whatever you want to do with it on top of it. So which, which chair we want to go with? I'm thinking this one. This is like one of the nicest chairs. Yeah, this is way better for a gaming setup, man. Way better. Now, I could have did something like these and then got rid of this out the corner. See, that kind of makes more sense, don't it? Can't really mess with these sconces on the side. We don't need the sconces on the side. We really don't. Matter of fact, what I'll probably do, take the sconce up. So we got, we got signs. We got signs. I forgot. These are new. These are gaming signs. Not necessarily for gaming, this type of gaming, but I do have some gaming stuff like that too. This one just say aesthetic. I do have a lot of these though. And then we got, of course, the traditional ones we had. With some of these was cool. Bad habits might be dope since some people consider gaming a bad habit. I don't, but some people would. This say games. It don't look like it say games. Oh, there you go. I don't know. That's kind of too obvious. This might be kind of cool, though. What y'all think? What y'all think? Like some neon lights? I don't really like the colors that come in all like that. This one say shine. This say game on. This one say Hell's Kitchen. 
<laughs> That's a nice looking sign though. Good branding. I don't know. I guess I'm kind of stuck with these like casino ones because none of these other ones look that great. Games Club kind of makes sense. Games Club and then maybe do this and this. How y'all feel about that? I mean, with this big ass wall, we could even make them bigger. I don't think we need bad habits then. We probably can bring that sconce back. That's kind of a weird sconce to have there though, ain't it? It makes no, like, it doesn't even look great. You know, these could actually go on the side. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm still thinking these through. You know, I like the pinks and, and reds and purples, so we might could just go with that. Like that. Maybe make these black. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm still thinking on it. I'm still thinking on it. I'm not a huge fan, but I'm not a, a anti-fan. You know what I mean? I'm kind of liking them, but I'm not fully sold yet. I need a little bit more decor on these desks. These desks are amazing. I love these desks, man. You can throw a little hat on there if we want to, just to kind of make it feel even more realistic. Probably got some headphones or something, too, we can throw on there. And clutter. Got the flashlight. <laughs> uh... We're not going to put this stuff in here. I don't even know where this stuff comes from. I think it comes from Wicked Whims, though. We got a hammer. Oh, you know what? I think I downloaded... I downloaded the whole situation where you had, like, ladders and all of that. Oh, there's mulch. Oh, that's dog food. I kind of want a dog. See, there's a saw. This is mulch, right? Potato chips. No, that's definitely not mulch. They got cereal. Oh, I downloaded a pantry. Yeah, I got a lot of little stuff like that now. Which is really cool because when we go into detail sometimes on stuff, it's going to really be helpful to that. Is this noodles? I guess you could act like you get, ate noodles. This is a little big for noodles, though. I feel like noodles are like that size. Like they was eating noodles when they was working. I don't know. I kind of like the noodle thing. That's, that's kind of cool just sitting there. Even though it's like it's always going to be noodles just chilling on your desk but it, it makes it feel real there's a loaf of bread that's kind of cool like you make sandwiches up here there's a lot of food items up here I, I forgot what i was even even looking for yeah i completely forgot what i was looking for Got a little tree you know that would make sense in the in the gaming room you might want to get lit before you make some uh everything seems a little big though yeah like that seems more the size that makes sense though that makes sense you might want to like i said get lit before you start streaming or something i like this room i like this room a lot i'm gonna get him a laptop over here too it's a little close to the wall but let's just do that let's just do that one we'll put this one on uh put that one on fortnite because they got fortnite up there too yeah 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 i like this i like this this desk is game changing I'm going to have to update my custom content folder for everybody on the OnlyFans because I got a lot of custom content that I didn't have now. Uh, and the OF gang got to stay. They got to stay on it. Got the little gaming glasses right there. Got uh, this little thing because it looked like art or something. That look, definitely looked like it would fit in this room. It's going through that desk though. I don't know. I could leave that there if I run out of space just to add something. But <laughs> I'm just looking for clutter right now. Oh, look at this sign. That's pretty dope. That's something I would buy for sure. I love, uh, like, statues like that for Christmas time. Big ones. Uh, yeah, man. I think we good. I think we good. These are computer hard drives. This one might be good, depending on the situation. All right, I'm going too deep now. Let's go to clutter again. There's so much stuff I got in here, man. Like, we got paint. We got, we got everything, bruh literally everything i just don't really know that actually works out well on the desk a little fallout people that's pretty much all the clutter space we got i mean maybe we can put one i just realized that's in interfering with that door kind of i like the little fallout people though that's kind of cool maybe i shrink them one yeah i might have to make this a single door i technically don't have to though but that is kind of interfering with that door. It looks so grand out here, though. We'll see. We'll see how it plays out. And then as far as this desk goes, maybe I'll still keep this. I don't know. What y'all think? Should I still keep the little vlogging station just for the hell of it? I don't know. Let me just see something real quick. See how it look and feel. Eh. 
it's it's kind of cool over in this corner though yeah it's kind of cool over in the corner i think i'm gonna get rid of the hard drives and we can put this camera over here too i think this is a pretty nice room though we just need like a gamer rug what kind of rug does a gamer have i don't know about this but we can see what they got eh, that's not bad maybe i can make this room purple and pink I don't know what the hell that was. Maybe we can make this room purple and pink though. And we can really like put the lights in and make it feel. You make it feel. This is a really nice size rug. It's not necessarily what I wanted, but like it's a big rug though. Let me let me see something. Let me see something. Technically we don't have to have this color in here either. I was thinking more like a gray might be lit. Like what y'all think like a gray? I don't know because a gray might darken it up too much. Let's just let's just pretend that this is the color. I hate these colors, man. This is gray. That's not a, the gray I'm talking about. Dark gray. So I was thinking dark gray with a gray floor. Dark gray floor though, and then the purples and pinks will really stick out. I might end up having to change this desk to gray though. See, it's kind of giving that gamer look going. It's kind of giving off the gamer vibe instead of the tan could also go with the solid black this i don't know personally i did like that brown but you could even do white too i don't know i kind of like this gray stone i definitely like the gray though the gray kind of gave it a look what are we gonna put on this tv i want something gaming oriented though i think that's apex right here yeah that's 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 not bad that's not bad I definitely like this color scheme. I might go ahead and do some more with the lighting though. I know you could put lights around the whole room. That might be something I'm interested in doing. This might be cool to go across the windows because you'd see that in the background. So that might be kind of cool. And then maybe have lights. I never did download these lights. Big shout out to the girl that sent me the, the, the TikTok ceiling light even though let me just keep y'all 1000 percent in the loop those around the room lights i've been doing that for years bro like i've been doing that since i was a kid because i first found out how lit that was at christmas time i had christmas lights around my room and i loved the glow so then i had put up leds in my room before that even became a trend now, i will tell you i have three strips i got a strip of white I got a strip of warm white, a strip of cool white, and a strip of full dream color RGBs. And it's important to have all three because I don't really use the cool one that much, but the cool one is lit if you want that daytime look. And it's also good sometimes to have a cool color with the RGB because sometimes the RGB can be dark depending on what color you got. And the, the white crispy lightens the room up with the RGB. And then, of course, the warm is what I use all the time when I'm in there just ch chilling. It's got a warm vibe. And then the uh, colors I usually throw on. I had a star projector with the colors. I might show y'all what I'm talking about. Throw a clip in. So I'm editing this video. I'm in my room. Bedroom vibes is lit. You already know I got some Kenan and Kale going. Big shout out to y'all for getting that 100K subscribers on the original channel. You know what I mean? We, we, we kicking out cooler. I do want to show y'all what I'm talking about. By the way, you see I added the plants in here because I told you the plants was dope. But check it. Alexa, activate bedroom colors. Hey, make sure you subscribe and ring that bell. <laughs> see what I mean? This is what I'm talking about. Now, I do sometimes have a cool strip that's going with that uh, RGB at the top. I guess I don't have that one set for this right now, but yeah, man. You know what I mean? Very lit. We got the stuff up there going. Got my star projector up there. The mirror's over there. Yeah, man. So I just wanted to let y'all know this is what I meant in the video because the, 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 the lighting in here is just next level. I love it. It's so, it's so much too because I got the fairy lights always on. I got a strip behind there. I got a strip behind the TV star projector then the three strips of led are up there and then i have a strip up there to give a glow and this is where i keep everything at is up here so like all the power stuff is up there so you don't see no cords nowhere in here like hanging down or nothing dope you know i just realized these windows aren't even 
This window is here. This window should be here. No wonder this picture wasn't even. Damn, I just realized that. Which is fine. Doesn't really change much, but this is sticking over the edge a little bit, which is cool, which is cool. I don't mind that. I just want this room to feel fun. And I might change this to something else. Might change this to something else. A lot of these aren't YouTube friendly. Well, that's not very YouTube friendly either, is it? I might throw her up. I might throw her up because her game and setup is dope. She got a dude, her and her dude, they lit, bro. They goals. Her and her dude are, are goals. I had to throw them on the screen. But her game and setup is gray like this, I think. And they got plants. Should I make this big, though? Or should I make it small? I'm, I don't know. I like it big, but I'm not like a huge fan of this rug either. It's so, yeah, we're going to leave it small for right now. It did look okay big, though. I mean, if we're going for crazy look, it's not bad. Let's just, let's just keep playing with it. See, it looks more like a respectable office like this. And then when you do this, it's like we went full gamer. Like, we don't care about nothing. We just gaming. I kind of like that energy, though. I like that picture, too. That picture matches up there perfectly. This is a nice little room. I think we're going to go just go in full-fledged with the gamer look. Why not? Yeah, this picture up here is amazing. I love that. I might go ahead and add some sconce action up there just to... Uh, that might not be the ones I need to do. Let me just go in here real quick and hit tab. Yeah, this is definitely feeling like a beautiful... Like, I could just... You could almost smell how crispy this room is. You got the AC blowing. Gotta have the AC in here with all these computers and TVs. This room got to have an AC unit of its own. This is nice, though. It's kind of crazy, but it's cool because it's a gaming room. Yeah, I like this. I like this. You wouldn't expect it either because, like, out here is super, like, chill and, like, classy with the colors. And then you go in there and it's like, damn, hella lit. So I like that. I like that. I think I'm going to go ahead and pause this episode here. That was a success. Nah, we gotta do the gym. We gotta do the gym. Yeah, we gotta do the gym. We gotta do gym, gym, gym. Look at gym, look at gym. Oh, we need a fan. Let's get this fan, too. Let's get this fan. We definitely need a ceiling fan in there. Keep that air flowing. Keep that air flowing. Yeah, I love this gamer room. That's a big upgrade over what it was. Now, over here, I don't know if we need this sign. I mean, this wasn't really nothing that meant nothing anyway. Might be kind of cool to have on the window though. Just because. Because that's literally just because. I mean, I don't know. Do any of these like make sense? Wild at heart might be. I mean, I don't know. I'm just adding them in there. I'll probably take them up because they look kind of dumb. So we're just going to leave them up there. And then, oh, these little lights. I could have used these instead of the, the ones I went all the way around with. Eh. The thing about this gaming setup is you can never really have too many lights. You really can't. It's no such thing as too many lights in a gaming setup. So maybe we could just throw a strip of pink ones right there just because. Just want to add lights. You can never have too many lights. I might change that picture too because it's just not really matching the colors. I like that one. That one's not YouTube friendly though. Is this one? Mm, that has all the colors and it's pretty YouTube friendly. So let's just go with that one. Yeah, that one's YouTube friendly. It's got the colors. I like that. It'd be cool if I could make this chair like purple, but I can't. They don't have like a purple chair, do they? Gaming chair that's purple. I mean, I could get any chair I want, but. Oh, this one's pink. Maybe I'll go with these because these give a little bit more color to the setup. You could replace this one too, right? Yeah. That way we got, yeah, I like that. So it gives it a little bit more color because why not? You know what I mean? I like this room. This room is really dope. Really dope. I like that a lot. Let's say this. I got some M&Ms right here. I'm going to just go ahead and put the home gym right there. And then I'll move this over. Mm, maybe when I had a treadmill going this way. I probably could add two windows here instead of just the one. That way I can get rid of this tree. I mean, I don't know. The home gym is probably going to get tossed together real quick because it's like i mean it's just a home gym i can't really think of nothing that i really would want to do that bad that's gonna make this like super different i mean we could throw like a gym picture on the wall for sure if i can find one yeah i don't really have no gym picture that i can find 
I mean, honestly, I might just go ahead and just pause this here because I'm, I don't know. Maybe I'll do the gym. I could do the gym gray too, though, couldn't I? We could do like a gray situation for the gym too. Ain't nothing wrong with a little gray to black to br break up the black and brown. See, gray kind of hit different, don't it? Like it's not as warm, but that's kind of good in some rooms. Some rooms you don't want it to be all warm. You want it to have that like bright energy to it. I can't even see what pictures I'm putting up because this damn thing is, I don't even know if I want to do that there. And I can't even tell because this stuff is in the way. Let me just put this here and let me see something. See, I kind of like these colors, the blues with the gray and whites. I mean, none of these really make that much sense though. I could put like some dumbbells over here. I could move this door over too. Let's go ahead and move this door over. Not the most realistic thing to just move a door over, but I'm thinking like right here, I could do like the dumbbell racks. Then we could have a home gym here. We got a little room on the sides for that. Treadmill could be right here. I could also keep the home gym here, add two treadmills here, or three. Could I put three? <laughs> yeah, I could put three. So you got three treadmills, a home gym. Okay, that's that, that, that actually doesn't look bad at all. Let me go ahead and put two more sconces over here too. I do gotta go through these pictures and like find something better though. And then as far as like the, I could have put a punching bag in here though. I could have put a heavy bag up, but it's like heavy bag or two more treadmills. Cause this is going to come out really, really far. Almost to the point where well, I could take one treadmill out. You know what? I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to get that one though. Cause that one's kind of unrealistic. You can't mount that to the glass. But I'm going to do this. That way we can have a heavy bag, but we also got two treadmills. I like that. I like that a lot. Got the two treadmills, the heavy bag. This picture is not bad though. It kind of ties in with the red. I wonder can I make these? No, nah, I think I'm going to leave them the color they are. Something need to go right here though. Maybe another picture. See, I was going to put a rack in here, but like, I don't know. Maybe I'll do the weights, some dumbbells. We'll do uh, this rack. The yoga mat, I don't know if we're gonna have enough room for this yoga mat, actually. I mean, it's not a huge gym. It's just big enough to have a couple things in it. Can I change these to red? Yeah, perfect. That way it just tie the colors in a little bit better. We'll put the weights right there. I probably should put this rack here because this is not a lot of space. Oh, you know what? We need mirrors. That's what we need. We need some mirrors up here. What's a gym without mirrors? That's a dumbass gym. That's what that is. Okay, let me put... Damn, I almost probably should put the mirrors on this wall, shouldn't I? And then just get rid of that other thing. I need to move this over, though, so it's together. Yeah, we can get rid of this. Maybe I'll put this on this wall. It don't really fit that great there, but... I mean, it's better than just not having nothing there. I might just center it, though. You don't see the other light, but that's, that's all right. And then we got the weights. We could just throw some weights in the corner just to give it kind of a look. I hope they can walk around them still. They should be able to. I probably should put this here, but I, that's just too close. Like, if I could do it like that, I would. But since it's so far away, I don't think I'm going to be able to. So I'm going to do it like that. Yeah, that's, that's a pretty nice home gym. Let's go on tab just to check it out. I mean, for a little tiny room, some of this stuff ain't even loading up. For a little tiny room, damn, it's not even loading. Yeah, this is pretty decent for a little hallway type home gym. You sit down here, do your, do your sets here. You got some free weights, a couple little things over there. Then you can come over here, hit the heavy bag or hit the treadmill, depending. Got a little picture. Yeah, this is a nice little gym. Let's try to hook these pictures up real quick though, just to be a little bit more gym oriented. Which I know this one, I don't know if I got anything that really makes sense in a gym. Oh yeah, I do. I got a Nike sign. That actually matches well in here. It's a little too promotional, but it works. And then with this one, I'm not sure at all. I know on that square one, I got a basketball one. I also got a shoe. It's not really gym oriented though, is it? Plus these really aren't the size I need. 
Maybe I don't have what I thought I had in here. Cause I swear I had one that had like a basketball girl on it. I got two Nikes. Damn, maybe I don't. I could definitely do the two shoes. Do I want to do the two shoes though? That's the real question. Nah, honestly, I like the, the abstract one better, honestly. It don't have to be gym oriented, I guess. This, this Nike one is enough. This is just a little decorative thing. If I find something later, I could always switch it out. But my menus are so messed up, I can't even scroll through what I'm looking at. I'm going to just leave this for this video. I'm going to scoot these treadmills in just a tad bit so they don't feel so close. I still got plenty of room. And we good, man. Go ahead and pause this episode, man. Let me know in the comments how you like the new home gym and how you like the new game and room office setup. I think the gym is nice. See, I'm about to mess around and go back gray and white and make this whole thing over and make it gray and white again. See, the thing is, I love the black and browns, but I also love the gray whites and chromes. So I'm always torn which one I like better. So we'll see. But let me know in the comments. I love y'all. Bop. Bing bop. Doop doop doop. That was amazing. All of those long, hard hours of working definitely pay off. Well. I see that. I see that. Sunny Daniel Enterprises.